Hi everyone! So today's video is going to be another haul video and this is part two of my Japan haul that I came back from recently. Um, I, also, I stayed in Kyoto and also Osaka as well and I've never been before. I'm splitting my haul videos into three parts since I did buy a lot of things. If you want to check out what I got in my last haul video, the link will be in the description. You can check out the different things I put in that video. And for this video, um, it has a different theme. It's going to be um, the much smaller items, um, mostly anime related because I do like anime and it does inspire most of my crafts and art that I do post here on my channel. But yeah, um, I just have to let you know what I got. We can get started. Um, the first little item that I have is this item right here. Um, it's when I went to Nara Park in Kyoto. And it's just a little tiny fawn or deer that um, is representing the Nara Park. Nara Park is full of wild deer that you can pet and feed and they're pretty friendly. Um, it's known for that as well and so they have a little deer, I guess you can say mascot or thing you can put on your shelf for the deer park and then it says cheerful Nara Park. And I do really like this because my favorite animal is a deer. So I was really happy to pick this up and I got this one for 700 yen so I couldn't pass this up because since as you can see it's really adorable and I'll be putting it on my shelf possibly. But yeah, that's just the first thing I got. A lot of the other things I did pick up at anime stores and also um, from when I went to the Osaka Aquarium I guess I can show you the thing I got in the Osaka Aquarium, which I do recommend by the way. It's one of the big, bigger aquariums in the world that has, um, that's known to have a whale shark that you can see and it's really awesome. I've never seen a whale shark up close before so it was pretty cool to see that. I'll probably have a mini vlog on my trip to Osaka and also Kyoto as well. Um, you probably could look for it in a few, maybe a few weeks since I do have to edit it. It takes me a while to edit things because I'm still not very good at editing but I do try my best. Osaka Aquarium is known for the whale shark. I picked up some stationery that was in the gift shop and it's um, Sanex Jinbei-san and I think he's adorable and he rep represents the whale shark of the Osaka Aquarium really well and he's really cute. Um, I can't show you the, the designs because I haven't um, opened it yet but this is what it looks like. I got this and also a, a letter set as well which I think is adorable and I'll probably be using these letters to send out to my friends when I send their packages or to give to them in person as well. And there's like, I'm um, sorry, and this is all the designs you can use with your envelopes. They just look like that. That's it, that's the first item. And I'm really happy to get more Sanex stuff because I used to collect them a long time ago and recently I haven't been keeping up with the new stuff but this one I had to pick up since I did see the whale and I have to kind of keep that as a souvenir. The next things I picked up were in the store called Anime, which is one of my favorite stores when I went to Tokyo. And they also have one in Kyoto, and they also have one in Osaka as well. So I was excited to go to those ones. Um, the, before um, you purchase everything, they give you this free postcard for one of the animes coming out. I don't know which is this one. Oh, I think it's called that. Or it's a Blu-ray actually coming out. I haven't seen this one. But if you've seen it, uh, let me know in the comments below. And then we can get on to the haul. Um, I got a lot of blind boxes and blind bags since um, I've been starting to make a new series on my channel. Like every episode, I'll open up a few boxes to see what I get. So I got a variety of things that I generally enjoy, um, in general, that I usually watch. So the first thing from that are these Love Alive Sunshine wafer packs. Um, they come with a wafer and they also come with a card so I'll be probably opening some of these in the video 
and this is the first design and this is the second design um, I only picked up a couple since um, I'm not a huge card collector but it'd be kind of cool to see which cards I get in this few packs that I picked up um, I also gave some to my friends as well so I if you guys do watch those videos, um, you can see what I gave them. Um, I'll probably be linking some of their opening videos in the description of the, these haul videos here. So yeah, it'd be really fun to see which one I get from the cards. Um, you can get a rare card with um, a gold foil signature on them. So I really hope I get one of those, or any card is fine. Maybe one with my favorite character on it. These Aqua... Love Life Sunshine stickers and I got five sheets. Um, I do plan on using some of these in resin because I do like to make resin charms with some of the stickers I buy. So I thought that'd be really cool and I can uh, make them into keychains or anything like that. So this is just a close up on what they look like. And they're very inexpensive. They're probably around a dollar or so. Maybe like a hundred yen or so. Sailor Moon Remint Birthday Cake Blind Box and I'm really excited because I am a big fan of Sailor Moon ever since I was a kid so I was really happy to pick this up and it's also by Remint. This is just the possibilities you can get. Uh, I'll show you really quick here. So yeah I'm really happy to have this and if you want me to open this you can also vote for it when I post the picture on my Instagram account. I'll also be putting the Instagram account where I put all of my anime related stuff and figure collections and cosplay related things. Um, that account in the description below so you can follow it or you can comment here in this video to see which blind box that I'm going to open. So I might be making a video on all the blind boxes I'm including in that in my blind box series so you can go check it out. Yeah that's the next item. Love Live 8-bit um, or 16-bit um, rubber straps and I really like these and I really hope I get my favorite character Umi because I'm collecting a lot of stuff from her to make an Ita bag and uh, I did open one in the first episode of my blind box series Lost and Found Blind Box so I'm really excited to start that and I will be putting this in that series as well so you can check it out these are all the possibilities um, as you can see on the side. So yeah. The next one I will show you is this uh, Sakura Card Captors keychain and I think there's um, random ones you can get. This is only 500 yen and there's 12 designs I believe as this says. Um, I'm really excited because I am also a fan of card captors as well as Sailor Moon so I'm a big classic anime fan I suppose so yeah I think this is gonna be really pretty and I can also put it on my bag as well or my cell phone this was this right there the next one I got is a lot of love life stuff because I'm a big fan of love life again so I got these two from love life sunshine um they're really adorable style um they're in their summer I guess summer uniforms or summer outfits and they're really cute um, these are the possibilities you can get here and my two favorite characters from Love Life Sunshine are Rico and Daya so I hope I get one of those again you can also vote for these as well if you want me to open any of these um, the next one I have is this Love Life blind box um, they're all in their maid costumes and I hope I get Umi again so <laughs> And if, if I don't get Umi, I'm really happy with any of the characters since I'm a big fan of Muse. And here's the designs. Tape's covering that one, sorry. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm excited. I don't think they sell these anymore um, in stores, so I was happy to find it in Japan. So, yep. And the next one is this Love Life Sunshine mascot, and it you can hang them on your earphones. And I think that's really adorable, so I hope I get my favorite character as well in this one. I really like tiny figures to put on display. So yep, those are the designs. This is really adorable, I was happy to get this. I only bought one box because um, I wanted to keep it, I wanted to keep a variety of things to get in blind boxes or blind bags. 
The next two things are Love Life once again. It is these two um, key chains. Um, they're pretty big. As you can see, the box is fairly large. Um, you can get 10 of the... Oh, sorry. Um, you can get 9 of the girls, but there's also a mystery one as well. Uh, I'm excited to open these. There's, the design is really cute. And I never had any of these before. I've never seen them. So, and it's hard to find Muse stuff nowadays. So, I was really happy to find these two. And I got two sets. It's all the girls in their Sunny Day Song outfits, which is one of my favorite songs. So, the next blind box I got is this Aqua um, keychain again or strap. And this one actually has water in it. So, I think that'd be really pretty if I had it on a a bag or something like that. I like to keep collect a lot of keychains and rubber straps and stuff like that. It's really fun and especially if the anime you really enjoy. It's nice to collect things from that series as well. And I think they have sparkles in it so I'm excited to see what it actually looks like. And the last but not least are these two items I got uh, from anime as well and I think these are super adorable and I'm excited to See which one I get from here. Um, it's the Love Life rubber strap and they're in their aquarium outfits and I really like this song as well. It's one of my favorites. I did buy the CD for this song as well, the single, so I'm really happy to have these as rubber straps. And these are, again, all the possibilities. And I think these are by Movic, which is actually a really good um, company. I do have a whole bunch of, I don't know if you can see it in this way, a whole bunch of Gashapon that I'm excited to open up in a video. So if you want to vote for any Gashapon, um, you can just leave a comment in my Instagram or also in this video as well. So yay! They're from different uh, series that I enjoyed, so, and maybe little cute figures as well. I'll just open them randomly and hopefully I get the one I want. So this is just a close-up on some of the items I had in this video. Um, I hope you liked watching. Thanks for watching till the end and let me know which blind box was your favorite from this video. And also hopefully I get the picture up on my Instagram um, so you guys can help me choose which blind box I can open first. Or you can comment in this video as well, I don't mind. I usually try to see your comments and try to reply as best as I can. And hopefully I'll get the third part of my haul up soon so just stay tuned for that. and. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!